Hello, second graders. Welcome to Learn and Share. We are doing five simple multiplication word problems. Problem one. Multiply the number of fingernails on two hands by the number of days in a week. What's the product? Feel free to pause the video to solve the question yourself. Let's review this. So we have to multiply the number of fingernails on two hands by the days in a week. How many fingernails are there on two hands? Right, there are 10. How many days are there in a week? Right, there are seven. So what we have to do is number of fingernails on two hands, which is 10, number of days in a week, which is seven, product equals 10 times seven equals 70. Yay, let's go. Problem two, multiply the number of wheels on five bicycles by the number of eyes of a dog. What's the product? Feel free to pause the video to solve the question yourself. Let's review this. So we have to multiply the number of wheels on five bicycles by the number of eyes on a dog. So the number of tires or wheels on one bike is two. Number of wheels on two bikes is four. Number of wheels on three bikes is six. Number of wheels on four bikes is eight. And number of wheels on five bikes is 10. So what are the number of eyes on a dog? Right, of course, there are two eyes on a dog. Now, let's do the final step. Let's go. Number of wheels on one bike is two. Number of wheels on five bikes is two times five, which is 10. The number of eyes of a dog is two. So the product will be two times 10, which is 20. Yay! Problem three, multiply the number of colors in the rainbow by the number of vowels. What's the product? Feel free to pause the video to solve the question yourself. Let's review this. So we have to multiply the number of colors in the rainbow by the number of vowels. How many colors are there in the rainbow? Right. There are seven colors in the rainbow. How many vowels are there in the alphabet? Right, there are five vowels, A-E-I-O-U. So the number of colors in the rainbow is seven. The number of vowels is five. So what we have to do is product equals seven times five, which is 35. go to the next problem. Problem four, multiply the number of tusks on three elephants by the number of wings of three eagles. What's the product? Feel free to pause the video to solve the question yourself. Let's review this. We have to multiply the tusks of three elephants by the wings of three eagles. Can you tell me how many tusks are there on an elephant? Right, there are one, there are two tusks on one elephant. So the number of tusks on two elephants will be two times two, which is four. And the tusks, tusks of three elephants are two times three, which is six. 
So we found that the number of tufts on three elephants is six, but how many wings are there of three eagles? So now, let's see. So the number of wings on one eagle is two. On two eagles, it is four. On three eagles, it is six. So what we have to do now is number of tusks on one elephant is two. The number of tusks on three elephants is two times three, which is six. The number of wings of one eagle equals two. The number of wings of three equal eagles equals two times three, which is six. So the product will be six times six, which is 36. Yay! Let's go to another problem. Problem five. Last problem. Multiply the number of oranges in half a dozen by the number of primary colors. What's the product? Feel free to pause the video to solve the question yourself. Let's review this. Multiply half a dozen oranges by how many primary colors are there? So how many are half a dozen of oranges? Right, there are six for a half a dozen. So how many primary colors are there? Right, there are three primary colors. So what we have to do now is number of oranges and half a dozen equals six. Number of primary colors equals three. Product equals six times three, which is 18. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. See you.